all so much for being here um, for the, the first preview screening of the Buddy System. Uh, this has been a labor of love over the past three years. We've had some bumpy moments, but uh, the end product is here. Every single person who is in this room is here for a reason. You're either a, a friend and supporter of the Buddy System, you might have a personal connection to the material in the film, you may be in the cast or the crew, or you might just like dogs, and, and that's okay too. So um, we're, we're thrilled to have you here. We're a little bit nervous, which is normal, and excited to finally share the film. Nobody has seen this other than the people working on it. We just posted a new trailer today, brand new. I haven't even seen it since it got posted. I mean, I've seen it, but I haven't. Um, we wanted to, to create a trailer that was more reflective of the film as it's evolved. So that is a way you can support us. Uh, many of you have already uh, given us money and been very generous and supported us, and we thank you. We're not going to ask you for more money, believe it or not. And those of you who are new to the Buddy System, after you see the film, if it so moves you, um, we would love your support. We would welcome it. Uh, everything's fully tax deductible. Our fiscal sponsor, uh, which we've done three films with them, is the Center for Independent Documentary. They're out of Boston. They've been around for 30, over 30 years, and they've helped shepherd many independent documentaries that have won Emmys and Peabody's and been nominated for Oscars. Yes. And Snowy is very excited about that. <laughs> By the way, Snowy and his handler Hunter is Snowy is a North uh, North Star dog in training. He's seven months old, and he will be uh, he, he's learning to be a therapy dog to help children who've undergone trauma or families. And again, please stick around. I want to introduce you to my team, uh, our team, and uh, many of the people in the film. So, yes, first preview screening, the buddy system. Zoom in. Well, I grew up with a pet dog, like most of us. But I really didn't come to appreciate dogs and what they can offer us until my son Danny was diagnosed with autism. autism. 